Web design, or more specifically UI design, has transformed in massive ways over the last three decades. In this video, we're going to take a look at the most notable design trends during this period. Now, For me, it's a bit nostalgic because I've been there nearly from the beginning. I mean, here I am, full on dork mode in 1998 with those beautifully beefy CRT monitors. So hang on, buckle up, and let's take a trip on the internet superhighway all the way back from 91 to now, 2022. The early 90s was culturally vibrant with bright colors and design. Unfortunately, the world's first website published in 1991 was anything but. Why? Because CSS didn't yet exist. Things were very crude at this point in time, but things started to get more exciting when CSS was released in 1996. Back then, UI UX design wasn't much of a thing. It was sort of like a newborn baby whose future relied on a lot of nurturing and growing pains. Now, many consider, myself included, the early 2000s the golden era of web design. It was exciting because we had exciting technology such as Flash to do anything and everything we wanted. And boy, did we. To advance studios was what every teenage web designer wanted to be. With the help of Flash, websites were highly animated, fully equipped with UI sounds and more. Here's Apple's website in the year 2000. There wasn't much physical space to design for because monitor resolutions back then were typically 800 by 600 pixels. But we can see that web designers back then were establishing some solid UI patterns that are still used today. Now during the same time, there was a subset of web designers who loved creating futuristic UI designs of this particular aesthetic. Around the mid-2000s, we saw the introduction of skeuomorphism in web design. Now, skeuomorphism just means making our digital layouts resemble real-world objects. Now, of course, not all design during this time was skeuomorphic. Some of the biggest internet tech companies were rather minimalistic. In the late 2000s and early 2010s, we saw a huge explosion of a new design aesthetic encapsulated by the term Web 2.0. This new design aesthetic featured a lot of bubbly topography and other such design elements along with gradients, drop shadows, glows, and more. After years of skeuomorphism and Web 2.0, we saw a dramatic shift in web design. Enter flat design. The pendulum swung over to the other side of minimalism. Fewer gradients, more white space, and more simplicity overall. These days, flat design and minimalism is still largely with us, except we've added a few more trends. Highly illustrative UIs with beautiful animations, a lot of color and depth, and even new morphism, glass morphism, and new brutalism. Personally, I'm excited for the future of web design. We have more tools than ever to create immersive experiences, and I believe inevitably, we'll experience a major shift into both VR and AR for UI design. And when that'll happen, I'm not sure. What do you think? Let me know below. By the way, if you want to level up your UI UX skills or your CSS skills, check out designcourse.com, my new custom interactive platform for becoming all things awesome.